because candlestick signals are the graphic depiction of what's occurring in investor sentiment. And the T-line is a natural Fibonacci support and resistance level. When you apply these two type of charts in combination, or these two indicators in combination, it pretty much tells you what is occurring in investor sentiment. As we can see in the Dow chart, there was some selling. And then Friday with the uh, Harami, today the positive open, closing above the T-line on the Dow, tells us we're probably back in with pretty good prospects that we're in the next wave to the upside. The same scenario can be applied to the NASDAQ with its bullish Harami on Friday and a gap up today doing a couple things. One, gapping up through the 50, closing above the T-line, and well above the candle that told us the bears could possibly be taking control. Today's positive trading coming back up above the T-line now favors the uptrend continuing, which is a case for what has been happening in this overall uptrend for the last nine months in the market that it's been taking profits, consolidating, and then continuing to the next move to the upside. Knowing that there's been a J-hook pattern created in the market, you can identify individual stocks that might be replicating that same pattern, such as Under Armour coming up, pulling back, now doing a J-hook type pattern, given the prospects of some good strong upside now that it's back up above the T-line. And another benefit of knowing what the pattern results should be, such as our re-recommendation uh, on Hertz recently, was based upon a J-hook pattern setting up coming off your morning star signal. Notice what the trajectory of the J-hook pattern has been uh, on the Hertz stock price, even with the markets trading off substantially over the past few days of trading before this uh, Next uptick, the J-hook pattern was continuing to work in stocks like Hertz, basically because the patterns themselves are the creation of investor sentiment that probably has something more to do with the, what's going on in, in an individual stock price versus what's going on in the overall market. Once again, knowing what the candlestick signals and patterns are representing based upon what happens in human nature time after time, it puts you in situations where the probabilities of making money are much greater. That'll be it. We'll see you in the chat rooms.